All right guys, so today I have something very special for you guys. We actually have a new track out here in the southwest of the Las Vegas Valley. We're roughly about 20 minutes to Harry Reid International and you have ample shopping around this area. But today we have Jessica, she's the sales rep for Richmond American Homes. And we actually have what, two new tracks here? We do. Um, this is Arbor Brook. Okay. And then we also have Stonehaven. So Arbor Brook is going to range from 2,100 square feet all the way to about 23. We've got the option for a downstairs primary suite in one of them. The other one's got four bedrooms upstairs. Really beautiful homes here. And we've got quite a few right now that are right down the street that will okay. be available for April closings. Uh, we offer special financing. Uh, with a lower interest rate as time as it qualifies as you qualify okay so let's start off by with arbor brook how many lots will be sold here there's going to be about 60 lots of arbor brook okay and stonehaven so haven is going to have the other half and uh what's price more on the higher price point uh the stonehaven collections okay stonehaven are going to have three car garages they're going to be around 2500 to 3000 square feet massive homes okay and uh, how many homes or models are you guys gonna have total we will have four homes total to okay. sh as models so for Arbor Brook right now we actually have two models but Stonehaven are we gonna have any models in the future we're gonna have two right here okay so guys this is where I tell you about you know with these new home tracks if you can get in at the beginning this is where you're gonna build that value that equity and by the time they built out that track what's gonna happen is you're gonna be in an equity position so if you're interested in buying now is actually the time to buy in the first phases right absolutely yep so um, the average size lots for uh, this community you're probably gonna have about 20 to 25 feet in the backyard from the back of the house to the block wall. So I would say five to 6,000 square foot lots. Okay. Now, does this community have SIDS and LIDS? No. So the HOA right here is gonna be about $60 depending. We've got, it's different when it's on a private street versus a public street, but I believe it's gonna be about 60 to 90, depending okay. on where you're at in the community. Now, uh, these two models here, what are the two models that we have here? Right here we have the pine. The pine is 2,200 square feet. And then this one over here is the Linwood and that one is 2,110 square feet. Now, you did mention that um, you guys are now doing spec builds. So let me let the audience know what spec builds are. So before this builder, you can actually pick a lot and you can actually pick your model. And based upon the model, you can do the structural options, you can do the elevation, you can add electrical, plumbing, you had so many options. But the way that the world is working today, especially with interest rates like you yes. mentioned, a lot of builders are going this direction where they're spec building. And what spec building is, based upon the current trends of that consumer, what they're looking to um, build, the salesperson will pick out all the options, right? Mm -hmm, absolutely. So right now we're going with what the masses loved when we did personalize the home. When you guys came in, went to the home gallery and picked everything out. So it typically every single time is white cabinets, white quartz countertops, upgraded ceramic tile flooring, and then some upgraded carpet going up the stairs and in the bedroom. So we took what was the most popular and made that in the specs. Now, the only differences in some of the specs is whether it would be white cabinets or it would be darker cabinets. Okay, so we got these two models here. I, I wanna take uh, the viewers into the model and if you can kind of show us, you know, the floor plan, what you think is gonna be included on the next spec because you mentioned earlier that there, I think there's a couple, what, maybe nine or 10 more specs that you guys are doing right now yeah. for April. Mm -hmm. So if we can walk one of these floor plans and kind of show us around, I'd appreciate that. Absolutely, let's okay. do it. All right, which one do you want to go Let's first? Let's go in this one. Okay. So again, this model was what? This one is the Linwood. The Linwood is 2110 square feet with the primary bedroom downstairs. Okay, so guys, remember that you had the option before, but they're gonna spec this out for you. One thing I've noticed as we are walking, there's solar panels, is that correct? The, it, there is an option to do solar if we took it from dirt. What we are doing is we're going to put a solar conduit on the house. Okay. That way you have the option to retrofit if you do decide you want to do solar in the future. I always tell everybody these houses are wildly energy efficient. I would say live in the house a year, see what your bills are, and then make that decision. Okay. Also, I've noticed because you guys are doing the spec build now, um, I'm looking at the texture. It's not your standard orange peel texture here, right? We have the Santa Fe or the Skip Trawl texture here, but then we have the 12 by 24 tile. So 
If I'm a buyer, how do I know what's included that's coming along? How does that work? Um, we will show you on the computer which every single thing that goes in the home. Now, this tile is pretty close to what you would get, maybe a little bit thinner, maybe a longer slat tile, but you are going to have a choice between Coastal Gray or Pebble Beach collection. So okay. this looks like it's the Pebble Beach. We've got the accessible beige, which is a grayish paint. You've got the higher baseboards, which is something that we are putting in each home. You will get a white quartz countertop with the mitered edge. Okay. So everything is on trend with white cabinets. You're gonna have the matte black poles or you're gonna have um, satin nickel hardware. Okay, so what it sounds like to me, if you guys are interested in buying a spec build, probably the best thing you need to do is when you come out here to meet up with Jessica, right? Just let her know that you watched this video. And what you need to do is find out which model or yeah, which model you like, because obviously there's nine. Once you find out which model is available, find out which lot is coming that could actually fit that lot and just ask her, what are all the upgrades? And you should be able to print all that Absolutely. out, right? With the pricing, mm -hmm. okay? Yes. All right, perfect. All right, show me what else uh, comes with this home or what we should be expecting. You will get stainless steel appliances. Okay. Washer, dryer, and fridge are going to come in each of our homes. Okay. Um, it'll be a side-by-side. -side. I mean, this right here, you're going to get that. You're gonna get a single bowl sink just okay. like that. Um, ceiling height, that is the ceiling height that you will be getting. So it looks like this is nine feet. Okay. Um, you will be getting that. And it looks like we have a covered patio because I remember during the spec years ago, we had the option to do half or the full. Mm -hmm. Does that come with it or is it case by case? It's again case with the... by case. Okay. We might just do it over one section, yeah. whatever the floor plan can allow. Maybe some of them we're gonna do it the entire width of the house or some may not get it at all. Now, who makes that um, design option? for that spec build. Is it you or is it a designer? It's the home gallery designer. So all okay. of those girls are curating um, the home gallery um, decisions. Got it. Now, uh, it looks like we have a bedroom down here. Can we take a look? Is yes. this the primary? Yes, it is. Okay. So when you come in here, all of our homes have um, standard included feature would be the pre-wire for a ceiling okay. fan. Now you might not get the ceiling fan in the one that you select, but you will have the uh, pre-wire there. Okay. So it's already done. And do we also get the cables here as well? Yes. The co coax cable mm -hmm. and the CAT6 as well? HGTV um, okay. flat screen uh, capability is also included. Okay. So we know in the past that you had some structural options here. Is this kind of like the standard, what we would get? Yes. Okay. Yep, you will get, for the most part, I mean, it's gonna be case by case scenario, yeah. but um, tile surrounds, sometimes you're gonna get the frameless shower enclosure. Okay. You're going to get under mounted sinks. And uh, I wanna jam upstairs real quick yeah. so that way we can kind of show them quickly. Because remember, at the end of this video, I'm gonna have a link in the description for the full video home tour, guys. Hey, Chuck, it's before we go upstairs, okay. I have to show you this pantry. That's going all the way underneath Oh, the you know stairs. what? This is actually a good idea. They took the stairs and they just utilized this and you might as well just take advantage of the situation. Also downstairs laundry room, which is okay. awesome. And you said the washer and dryer comes with it, yes. right? Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay, and this is all GE package appliances, yep, correct? exactly. Okay. Now guys, we're gonna head upstairs real quick. So. Typically, this would be a pony wall. Obviously, this was an upgrade. And again, this is where you're gonna have to check if part of your spec, if this is also included. Yes. Okay. It could be a mission style railing, or it could be something like this. I mean, we're doing all different ranges. Okay. And the elevation of this home, how many elevations do you have? Four. Okay, so four on each one? Yes. And what about the color schemes? They're, yeah, they've got lots of different earth tones. Um, mm -hmm. We're doing, I think we're getting rid of like the red Spanish tile. I'm just trying to modernize the community. That makes sense. Can we go take a look at the other model? Absolutely. So this model that we're heading over to, what was the name of this model? This one is the Pine. In uh, square footage, bedrooms and bathrooms? This is 2350 square feet. Uh, we've got it modeled with four bedrooms and an office, but mm -hmm. this could have a fifth bedroom downstairs. Okay. Uh, do you notice uh, buyers prefer the fifth bedroom downstairs versus just having the four? Any bedroom that's down is really ideal. That's what people are looking for because that can take care of the masses. Everybody can purchase a home if they need one for um, 
a grandparent mm -hmm. or somebody that can't climb stairs, it's a perfect option. Now I've noticed uh, the landscaping, is all this included and also these pavers as well? You will get a standard landscaping package, uh, pretty comparable to what you see here. You will get the pavers included in all of our homes up the driveway to the front of the house and in the back of the house. Okay, I can't wait to go take a look at this one. Yeah, let's take a look. Okay, so what do we have going on here? We have bathroom here. Right when you walk in, you're going to see the dining room here that we're ta we're using right now as a stand-in mm -hmm. office. you have got garage here, powder bathroom downstairs. Can we take a look at the garage? Absolutely. In the garage, you'll see every Richmond home comes with a tankless water heater and a soft water loop. Okay, so it all comes with the ream tankless water. Yes. Okay, which is a plus. Also, one thing I've noticed here is that a lot of builders do not utilize this, which is, I don't know why, and this is one of the cool features about Richmond American Homes. They actually have a supply line for uh, the landscaping, so whenever you leave on a trip, you can turn off the main supply to the house, but then you still have water going to your landscaping, so that is a plus. Now, does the soft water loop Always. gonna come with it? Yep, okay. comes included. You just gotta buy the tank. Okay, perfect. Now, I've noticed on the floors here, this one is completely different from the first model. Mm -hmm. So again, this is important. If this is the floor plan that you like, you need to take a look at the options list to make sure you get all this stuff, right? Yes. Okay. So we have the main living area right here. You're gonna get the standard on the um, 12 foot slides down the center as well? Um, not standard, but what, you know, it'll be a case by case scenario. If not, it'll just come with a one six foot slider. Okay, so that's something you guys definitely need to uh, take a look at. Also with the covered patio. Now the landscaping in the back, just all raw desert. It's always gonna be raw desert. Okay. You've got about a year to do your backyard. Okay. And the normal lot size as far as the setback to the house, how, how large is that? I because would say about 20 feet. Okay, so that's good enough to put a pool. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Now, uh, with the pricing uh, for the lots, are there gonna be a premium as well with that? There will be. Okay. Mm -hmm. And they'll range. I mean, they could range from 5,000 to 25,000, depending on where you're at in the neighborhood. Okay. Can we go upstairs and take absolutely. a look? Absolutely. Now, if somebody's very interested in purchasing a home, how does that process work here? Do you just give like some sort of deposit and how much is that deposit? What are the steps? So the steps would be, we give 2% of the total purchase price for the spec, which could range, so about seven grand or so, give or take. And then you have 30 days to obtain financing. We have our own lender, um, Home American Mortgage. And once you uh, apply online, you'll pretty you'll know pretty soon um, if okay. you're gonna use our lender. So what is the current incentives right now if we decided to move forward, we put down that deposit, we're using your lender? We have special financing, so we've got our own internal buy down. So it takes, right now, I mean, I don't wanna quote interest rates, but yeah, it's yeah. always changing, but right now it's about 4.5% for FHA or VA, a 5-1 arm, 5% okay. uh, for a fixed FHA or VA. Um, with that, that's about 30 or 40 grand that we are internally buying down. And right now we've got some great incentives on closing costs. We're actually giving that buy down plus $10,000 in closing costs. Oh, wow. Mm -hmm. So that should be enough to cover a lot, right? Pretty much, yeah. Okay. So it looks like we got a bedroom here, another bedroom here. Is this a third bedroom? Yeah, one, two, three, and then we have the primary. Mm -hmm. Can we just take a look at the primary Absolutely. real quick? Absolutely. Yeah. Because I think that's important. Obviously you guys have larger floor plans. Yes. What was the largest floor plan? The Sage. The Sage, and uh, how big was that one? The Sage is 2,800 square feet. 2,800 square feet, okay. So how long are the builds right now? It takes about four to six months to build. That's actually pretty fast. Mm -hmm. It seems like it really dropped down pretty quickly. Yeah, we've really cut a lot of that time down. Okay. Now is there anything else that I've missed? No. That we need to cover? No, I think you got everything. I think we did a pretty good job. Now guys, if you guys are actually interested in this track, make sure to check out Jessica or Beth and let them know that you've seen this video. That's the most important thing. Also, if you guys wanna see the full video home tour of both of these models, I will also have a link in the description below or I might pop something up here or something up here. Jessica, thank you so much. I appreciate Absolutely. it. Absolutely, always a good time. Thank you.